What's going on guys? I know some of you may know and some of you may not. It's been a really difficult time for me at the moment. About 10 days ago I was admitted to hospital with a suspected heart attack um, at just 31 years old. Actually what I did have is a myocarditis attack. So actually my heart was inflamed um, caused by what we think is a virus. I'm still trying to get to the root cause of it with blood testing um, etc. I'm off my own back but Long story short, I'm very fortunate to be here. To be honest, I was probably 10 seconds away from dying. I had a heart rate of 250, uh, a blood pressure of 60 over 30. And to be honest, my fitness saved me. There, there's no two ways around it. Um, and the reason I'm doing this video is, is first of all to thank everyone because people have just been absolutely amazing. I've had clients, friends, acquaintances, people from the past, just just everybody has been amazing. People have come to visit me in hospital, I've had cards, messages, emails, you name it. And actually that support has really helped me get through this tough time because there was a period in time where I didn't think I was going to make it. And for someone who takes so much pride in his health, trains every day, uh, I eat a paleo diet, I eat well, it's very difficult to be faced with the fact that actually, despite all that, at 31 years old, you're going to lose your life. And uh, it's been hard to get to terms with, a lot of emotion, and it's a life-changing experience. And I think it's really important for anyone out there who is aspiring to be an entrepreneur and is really driven to make money and be successful is not to actually do it at the expense of your health. Don't drill yourself into the floor. It's not going to give you any benefit whatsoever. All these entrepreneurs and these social media guys out there saying, yeah, you only need three, four hours sleep a night, always on the grind, always on the grind. It's just nonsense. It's about how productive you are in the period that you're actually awake. And I fell into that trap. I fell into the trap. I think it's more is better. Um, I have been pretty successful financially, but at what expense? The richest man in the graveyard? I mean, that's no good to me. And I think I, you know, I have to learn from this experience to actually be a lot more productive, make sure that I'm not only training and eating well, that's just a small part of being healthy, is to actually sleep more, um, de-stress, meditate, do yoga, and all those things are just as important. And looking at passive income and passive income models that, that pay you for, for actually resting or doing anything, uh, are also massively important, but you don't go and attack those and try and find those um, for the sake of your health. It's, it's just not worth it. And guys, um, I can only use this experience to make me a better practitioner, a better person, and, and educate you guys going forward. So my new website will be live tomorrow, www.conquerwealth.net. It has been in the, in the works for a while now, and now seems a really suitable time to get it going. And on there will be everything from nutrition advice to training advice to entrepreneurial advice to relaxation advice. Anything that is revolved around basically being healthy and wealthy. We're going to cover on there. We're going to have, I'm going to have a podcast, radio show, YouTube videos. Um, anybody that wants to come on and has some value, be more than glad to have you on. If you just want to get in contact with me, send me a an inbox, a DM here. Um, but if you've got any questions, guys, about anything at all, even myocarditis and, and, and actually those heart issues, and if you've got a loved one that's dealt with that, I'd be more than glad to answer those questions. Um, but for now, it's a new chapter in my life. Uh, we're moving on. I am still here. We've got to turn this into a positive. And um, what, doesn't, what doesn't break you makes you stronger, hey? Eh?